Good take, good take. That's a good run, good run. Let's go. As the new men's basketball coach, it will be Pete Garashi's job to improve on the team's three win, 15 loss record from last year. I'm going to be looking for continual improvements in my team. I think any time a, a new coach comes to a group of players, he comes with his own philosophy and it takes, takes time for the players to start to adopt it and to understand what he wants on the court. So that's going to be a process and as long as I see my team growing and developing uh, throughout the course of next season, I'll be happy. I don't put pressure on my players to win games, but I put pressure on them to improve. So off-season and skill work and their commitment is very important to me. If I have a, a student athlete for five years, I know I can make a lot of gains in their game, but they have to be willing to put forth the effort to get better. So I'd say I'm, I'm a development coach. I try to teach the game as best as I can and I try to stay away from the yelling and screaming. <laughs> Long term, I want this team to be competitive, I do, not only in the Canada West, but nationally. I, mean, I think every coach should have that goal to get on the national scene, and uh, long term, I'm looking to build a solid program that will be able to compete with anyone in this country. Garashi brings both playing and coaching experience to Kelowna and feels that the university and the city will be able to attract top-notch talent. I coached uh, McEwen as a head coach last season in Edmonton. Before that, I was an assistant with U of A and right here at UBCO. I think uh, what I bring to the UBCO program is mostly my playing experience. I have a, a, lo a long playing experience. I got to play at pretty high levels. I played on the Canadian national team. I got to play overseas for 12 years. So a lot of my coaching background just uh, right now it comes from my playing background, kind of a, assembling you know, bits and pieces from the various coaches I played for and try to mold it into something that I can call my own. Here in Kelowna, it's an interesting place because I, I see a lot of potential. It's a, it's a great university, great academic institution. It's a great city. I think it'll be very attractive to a lot of players once we get ourselves on the map in the CIS scene. Uh, I see a lot of growth and potential, and I'm excited to, to just kind of put us on the CIS landscape and get some interest generated and see where this program can go. So far, the new bench boss liked what he saw at his first mini camp. I thought it was great. You know, we went through some drills and they weren't, some of them were, the concepts were a bit new to some of the players, but they competed hard and I got to get a good look at some guys that we're considering for next year's roster. So I'm really happy with the competition. Just a chance to get out on the court here at UBCO finally, you know, put on a, a heat polo and, and coach. I'm, I'm excited and thrilled to be here.